Yeah, it owns more Catholic and Henderson County High was supposed to be playing it today. In fact, the Lady Aces were supposed to face George Rogers Clark High from Clark County tonight in their first round game. Instead, they're back home tonight without even getting to their first, getting to their first tip off for the tournament. Instead of being on the court at Rupp Arena, the Lady Aces suddenly found themselves back at their home court. It was heartbreaking. For senior guard Spencer Harvey, the ride back to Owensboro marked the end of an emotional day that started with so much hope. Waking up this morning, so excited to be able to play on Rupp and then getting the news that we didn't get to play. And then our senior season ended that way and not being able to play a game, so we don't get to know how it would have ended. They learned of the postponement as they were watching South Laurel against Sacred Heart. Henderson County's game against Marshall County was the next scheduled game. KHSAA officials say their intention was to complete both girls and boys tournaments with restrictions, but say it didn't appear as a wise option and wouldn't benefit the players or fans. It's tougher on me and to see them uh, just take it as hard as they have. I mean, they didn't get that chance to go out on their own. Head coach Michael Robertson says he understood the decision, but wishes he was able to coach this team for one final run. This is our third straight time, but uh, the freshmen that came in this year, uh, their opportunity may have been lost because uh, you never know if you're going to get that opportunity again. Uh, you hope you are, uh, and I hope we do, but uh, for that, it, that's, that's a sad point. The Lady Aces weren't even the only Owensboro Catholic team impacted. The boys' basketball team was supposed to play in their state tournament next week, along with Madisonville North Hopkins. And in their statement released earlier today, KHSAA officials say they'll soon make an announcement about refunds on tickets. All right, now could either of these t tournaments or both still be played later this year? Well, in that same statement, KHSAA officials say they will try to find options for rescheduling later this spring. But they first need approval from the governor's office, the public health commission, mm -hmm. and the state department of education. Okay, still some few hoops to jump through. All right, thanks a lot, Mike.